you clicked on this video today because you know and you believe that there is more to life than what you have experienced so far. There are many preachers online saying that Jesus is coming soon. And a lot of you think it's a joke. Some of you are convicted. You are ready to give your life to Jesus. In this video today, I am going to tell you why you need to make the choice to choose Jesus. Because heaven is real. Hell is real. And there shall be a judgment. Stick with me to the end of this video and I will help you to pray and ask God to get saved. In the beginning, when God created heaven and earth, God made everything good. God decided that he was going to create men. And so the first man and woman was created, Adam and Eve. The Bible said that God gave them instructions relating to a tree that they should not eat from. There came a day when Eve went close to the tree while she was looking at it. The devil came in and he lured her to taste the fruit. And ever since that day, mankind have been living in sin. There was a fall from grace. And this is how the destruction of man began. And so the Lord, he exiled Adam and Eve from the Garden of Eden, where there was peace, where they have everything to their comfort. And so men became sinners, men became lustful, men became disobedient to God. We became estranged from God. The powerful thing here is that God did not leave us in that state of destruction. And so he decided that he was going to give unto man a way to redemption, which is the second Adam, Jesus Christ, whom we all know and love. Jesus Christ came and he died just so we could go back to God. Jesus did it just so we could be redeemed. The Bible said, no greater love hath no man than this, than someone who would die for his friends. Hallelujah. He died for you. He died for me. And God wants you to be saved because he said in his words, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whoever, it doesn't matter where you are, it does not matter who you are, as long as you are a human, he loved you so much that he died for you. Oh, hallelujah, that is, that is phenomenal. And so today, as you listen to me, may the God that loves you convicts your heart that it is time to choose him. Hell is real. There is a day of damnation. There is a day of judgment. And we want you. I want you. God wants you to be saved. God wants you to make heaven his home. Believe it or not, most people are going to choose the broad way. And that is the road to hell because you can do what you want and live how you want. Few are they that find the narrow road. And so today, I invite you to try Jesus. I invite you to try Jesus. Hallelujah. Try Jesus. <clears throat> try Jesus. Everything else will fail. Everything else will fade away. But Jesus, he will remain. Heaven is a place of peace 
There will be no more crying. There will be no more sickness. It is going to be man living with God in harmony. Man worshiping God. And I don't know about you, but I get excited whenever I think about meeting with him and worshiping forever. I want to say a prayer with you. If this video convicted your heart and you have decided that you want to give Jesus a try and that you want to make it to heaven, I want you to say this prayer after me. And as you say this prayer, if you believe with all your heart that Jesus is real, that he died on the cross and rose the third day for you, he is going to come into your life and he is going to save you. Father, in the name of Jesus, I just want to thank you that you chose me to be in your kingdom. Lord, come into my heart. Come into my life. Make me a new creature. Transform me, O oh God. Hallelujah. May my soul be connected to you again. Restore me to you, Father. I repent of all my sins. I turn to you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. If you prayed this prayer, I am excited for you. Congratulations. Find yourself a local church that is filled with the Spirit of God, that stands on the Word of God, that will uplift you, that will encourage you. Hallelujah. The songwriter said, Elevation Worship, may his favor be upon you and a thousand generations and your children and their children and their children. That is what God wants to do in your life. Comment down below. Amen. I prayed I am saved. So subscribe to this channel for more uplifting and God-filled videos of prayers and worship. Thank you so much. I'll see you again soon.